The Bernstein Bears in the Jump Rope Contest by Stan and Jan Bernstein. Brother Bear was very good at sports and games. He was good at football. He was good at basketball. He was good at soccer. And he was good at baseball. Bear was good at those things too, but she was smaller than Brother and younger, so she could not do those things as well as Brother. There was one thing that Sister could do better than Brother though. That was jump rope. She could jump rope much better than Brother. Uh-oh. She could jump. She could skip. She could hop. She could jump slowly, she could jump fast, and she could jump very, very fast. <laughs> Be careful, sister. Sister was proud of her rope jumping. She was so proud of her rope jumping that she began to boast a little. I'm the best jump roper in bear country. I'm the best jump roper in bear country, she said. Sounds like she's being boastful and bragging. She began to boast a lot. I'm the best jump roper in the whole wide world, she said. <gasps> Look at Mama and Papa. Hmm. It was quite a boast, but one day she got a chance to prove her boast. Well, look, said Papa. It says here in the newspaper, that there's going to be a big jump rope contest at the playground. Sister said, I'm going to enter that contest and prove that I'm the best jumper in the whole wide world. It's not a good idea to be so boastful, said Mama. Why not, said Sister. Because there may be someone who is a better jump roper than you, said Mama. Ha! Huh, not a chance, said Sister. Watch this. Then she jumped rope so fast, she was a blur. Oh, it's hard to see her. She's jumping so fast. The day the contest came. All of the jumpers were there with their jump ropes. The winner would be the one who jumped the longest. Ready? Get set? Jump, said the judge. Sister outjumped Lizzie. She outjumped Queenie. She outjumped Babs. One by one, all the other jumpers dropped out. It looked as if Sister would be the winner. But wait, there was still one other jumper. It was Mr. Frog. Where had he come from? Mr. Frog had hopped out of the woods with his little green jump rope. Now he and sister were the only ones still jumping and it was starting to get dark. <gasps> sister and Mr. Frog jumped and jumped and jumped and jumped. Sister was getting tired. Her legs began to hurt. Her arms began to hurt. She was beginning to hurt all over. But Mr. Frog looked fresh as a daisy. He looked as if he could jump all night and the next day too. <gasps> sister looked worried, but brother had an idea. Keep jumping, sister, keep jumping, he shouted. It's getting dark. Sister didn't understand. What did getting dark have to do with anything? What it had to do with was lightning bugs. Lots of lightning bugs were coming out. And look, the frog's noticing them. Mr. Frog just loved lightning bugs. Soon, he stopped thinking about jumping and began thinking about the lightning bugs. He shot out his long sticky tongue and wham! But he missed. 
His long sticky tongue got tangled in his little green jump rope. <gasps> Mr. Frog fell to the ground in a sticky green tangle and Sister kept right on jumping. <gasps> Hooray, Sister wins, shouted everyone. <gasps> Look, Sister Bear's a winner. Sister learned a lesson that night. You don't have to be the best in the whole wide world to be a winner. You just have to keep jumping. The end.